started writing. I think it, everything started when I met my husband. Back in 2015, um, he, when I met him, he bought an Ultra Classic, 09 Ultra Classic Harley Davidson, and I fell in love with it. We would ride everywhere, go on dates on the bike. Um, we like going on cruise nights and, you know, just going out on dates, eating and stuff. Um, and one day I decided, I told him, I'm tired of riding in the back, like, I want my own bike. So we kind of looked around, we went to different dealers, but it never happened. I never, you know, we never made a deal anywhere. So I remember in 2019, um, he sends me a text message and he tells me, it was our wedding anniversary that day, and he tells me, he sent me a picture of a 09 Road King here from Laylaws, and he tells me, um, this is yours and I was at work and I'm like what so I worked out in Alhambra and as soon as I was out I rushed over here to lay laws and he was like it's yours it's your gift and I was like what so I was pretty excited um, that same day we took the bike home and we went riding out in a local parking lot nearby and I fell in love with it I loved it um, we rode around for a while he taught me the basics, you know, never let go of your clutch. Um, if something's going on, always hold on to that clutch. He taught me how to like stop, quick stops, and just the basics. We practiced around more, and until one time, I remember we were practicing at the parking lot, and I ended up dropping the bike. So I dropped the road key, and I panicked. I was like, I don't think I want to do this. Like, I was scared. Um, I never rode before, never dirt bike, never, never, nothing. So I was like, I don't know if I want to do this. So I kind of stopped, I backed up. So I was like, okay. And actually this year, um, he, I decided I took I, to take my writing course, the classes. I was like, I'm going to take the classes. So for my birthday in April, that was my gift to myself. Um, I paid for my classes and ended up um, passing. I passed and went to the DMV. I got my license in um, April. And in July, July 5th, he surprised me again. He got me this soft tail. Um, and the, right, the same day we went out riding, we went on the block, him, his cousins, friends. We went out riding the whole Baldwin Park and I fell in love with it. This bike is not as heavy as the Road King, so I felt like I had a little more control of it. Um, and ever since then, I've been riding. So we do enjoy going out to cruise nights. Um, we actually went to a show in Long Beach. Um, um, it was a big show, motorcycles, cars, and that was pretty fun. We've done a couple shows where um, there was a summertime cruise during the summer and my bike did win third place. So that was pretty exciting. It made me want to ride more, be out there, you know, everyone was, everyone acts different when they see a girl riding. It's different because you don't see a lot of women riding. So I thought, I. It makes me feel like I'm, I don't know, I'm doing something right. It just, it feels good. Um, and it's just the feeling of being out there, the wind in your hair. I love it. I love riding. So the look of my bike, it's more like a Cholo Vicla look, uh, more gangster style look. Mostly um, it's more like Chicano style, um, more of where I come from. I am from Mexico and um, you know, this is mostly what we ride. I was brought up to mostly Viclas. Um, mostly the people we ride with, we pretty much all have Viclas. And it's just the style, I love it. I love the loud pipes, like people can hear you from a mile away. Like, oh, there they come. So um, the bars, I love my bars. I didn't like being down here. I didn't like those beach bars. I wanted to be up here, you know? Just makes you feel like this is my bike. Like, I love it. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I do also always carry my bandana here as well. Um, my Mexican flag. And yeah, that's, that's pretty much it on my bike.
This is my 2005 Softail Heritage. Um, it is a five speed um, with the 88 engine. Um, so um, I'm gonna start off with the front of my bike. Um, it does have a 21 inch by three and a half DNA wheel. Um, my headlights over here, they're LED headlights as well as the passing lights. Um, some accessories I added to the front would be smoked out lenses in the front, just to give it that old school look. Um, it does have the chrome forks and cans that I switched out. They weren't chrome before. Over here, I have my bars. The bars, this bike used to have um, 35 inch beach bars. So I switched them up to 16 inch eight pangers just to give it that gangster look. I didn't want to be down here. I wanted more of up here. On this side, my engine, pretty much all chrome accessories. Um, anything chrome I see, I want it. I want it on my bike. I just want her to look shiny. Um, I also got the Samsung True Duels exhaust with the 39 inch fishtail slip-ons from Steady Customs. Um, on this side, pretty much those are my, my back lights as well. I added some more chrome to this side. I added the chrome neck covers in the front and then the swing arm on this side. The swing arm on this side, chrome covers. Some more chrome covers up here to the motor and my seat, it is um, more of a low profile seat just to give it that gangster look and it is um, La Perra seat. I'm still working on some more things. I am gonna switch out my cables to chrome cables, chrome housings on the top. And I also have four speaker pods on each engine guard. Um, my husband does work on systems, so he did install the whole system on my bike. As well as this up here, he installed a Bluetooth um, controller. Pretty much if I want to change my music, I can change it from here, higher it, lower it if I don't have my phone in hand. Um, and he also installed LED lights at the bottom of my bike, which pretty much I can turn them on from here. That way she can glow at night and anyone can see me in the street. And that's my bike. I think plans for the future. Um, I do want to ride to national parks. I always watch Matt's YouTube videos and I love the scenes. Like everything he goes and does, like I want to do that. Maybe not on the soft tail because it might be a little tough ride on it, but I do want to be out there and I do want to explore. I do want to ride everywhere and just see new things.